Hi everyone, Miss Nicole here. Back again for our third week of family trivia. Um, we've had a little bit of participation this week. Um, we're going to give it just a couple more minutes to see if anyone hops on. Um, next week we're going to do a little bit different where I'll do a video or of some sort and um, with the questions and then we can do a video with the answers. So a little more interactive in that sense. So just wait just another minute. I hope everyone is doing well, hanging in there. Um, I've been on spring vacation, I guess you would say. Um, <laughs> cleaned a room a day. That's about that's about all it can be done right now, but it's good. Everything is good. So, all right, we're going to get started here. Gosh, hot mess today. And I'm going to go over our questions and give you the answers. And then we will um, announce another winner. Um, so the first question was, this week our theme was music. Theme is music. So our first question is, the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame is in which state? And that state is Ohio. It is in Ohio, um, Cleveland, Ohio, to be exact. So I don't know if anyone's ever been there. I, I've never been there. Been in the Basketball Hall of Fame, but not the Rock and Roll. So that answer was Ohio. Um, it's number two, what is Justin Bieber's number one song? Don't worry, I'm not going to sing it for you. Um, but his number one song overall for like three weeks in a row or however they do that um, was Sorry. I thought it would be Baby. That would have been my guess, but his number one song overall is Sorry. And you're welcome for not singing. Number three, how many keys are there on a piano? That one is a good one. That has 88 keys. 88 total keys on a piano. Anybody out there know how to play a piano? Maybe you could send us a little video of you playing on a piano. I can't. I am not musically inclined at all. All right, number four, name a Bruno Mars song. Any Bruno Mars song. Just the way you are, Grenade, The Lazy Song. Been there this week. Um, treasure, any Bruno Mars song. He has a bunch out there, so name any one of those. All right, number five. How old is Taylor Swift? She is 30 years old. She's 30. She's getting up there. Um, she was born December 13th, 1989. So if you guessed 30, good job. Number six. You're going to name the song or artist or both. That saying, clap along if you feel like a room without a roof. is an easy one. That was Pharrell singing Happy. I know there's a bunch of Minion fans out there. So um, that was his, that was a very popular song a while back. So Pharrell and Happy is the answer to number six. Number seven, who sings Thank You Next? And that would be Ariana Grande. I don't know that song. I really don't. I'm sure it's popular and most of you all know that, but I don't know that one. So um, let us know in the comments if you that's one of your songs that you like. Number eight. What is the world's most played song? And that is Shape of You by Ed Sheeran. Shape of You was an answer to number eight by Ed Sheeran. The world's most played song. That's what everyone's listening to. Number nine, name an instrument in the brass family. Any instrument, that could be a trumpet, tuba, horn, French horn. There's a bunch of other horns out there. That is all in the brass family. So we have taken any of those answers. And number 10, which is I want you to comment in the comments below. We can read those later. You don't have to do it now. Comment later your favorite song. What is your favorite song? What have you been listening to on repeat this whole time we've been stuck? I know you all have been listening to a bunch of music. So if you comment below and what is your favorite song, all-time song, you can listen to any. Mine, 
any boys to men song. I don't have a specific one. It's any boys to men. It ages me a little bit, but that's okay. Um, or really any 80s, 90s R&B. But boys to men, any of their songs. So make sure you guys comment below um, your favorite song, what's gotten you through these times that we've had lately. Um, and again, this week, second week in a row, we have Lee and Tamara. You guys won it again. Yay. You guys did a great job answering all those questions. Um, you get a Down Syndrome Association of Greater Charlotte t-shirt. So be on the lookout for that. But thank you all. Like I said, next week we're going to do a little different. We'll have a video of the questions, a video of the answers. So that way you can just kind of watch and play along at your leisure. So hope you guys are all doing well. Um, and we will see you next time. Don't forget to comment your favorite song that you've been listening to nonstop since you've been stuck at home. So anyways, we'll see you guys later. Bye, everyone.